Good morning guys. I have just finished filming a video. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do today. Fridays I don't work. Um, I was gonna go to the gym but it is currently in the middle of a heat wave in Perth and it's like 40 plus degrees. Plus I put makeup on for my video and I don't want to look like a weirdo at the gym and sweat it all off. So maybe I'll just bum around the house like I always do. Hey. So what I actually do to keep my cats cool, especially in the summer, um, my vet actually told me to do this. So you just grab two tea towels, doesn't matter how big they are, obviously big enough for your cat to fit on them. Um, and then you wet them completely in wet cold water and lay them on the floor and they actually come and sit on the tea, what was I saying? On the tea towels and it cools them down just like the damp coolness, um, especially if there's a fan on, obviously it cools them down as well. Um, what I also got told that you can do is get a wet cloth and just wipe them down gently. I'll show you how to do that actually. So there's Nala. And her little wet tea towels are nice, jelly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're so cute! Are you showing off for the camera? Oh, yeah, I'll show you how to wipe them down. Okay, so I've just wet a little mini cloth and I'm gonna wipe it down over Nala. So softly. Oh, and she's purring. How are you doing? Oh, is it nice? Oh, what is this? Yep. So they're literally like not so you can wet or anything, they're just <laughs> slightly damp and it just cools them down. Who doesn't want happy kitties? Happy kitties. Oh, they're nice, more water. Oh, that's so good. Come here, girl's turn. She's like, bitch, I'm sleeping. Give them fresh water every day, sometimes twice a day if they need it. And I actually put ice cubes in the water because it keeps it nice and cool for them. And then if they drink it or it's really hot and it evaporates really quickly, obviously the ice will melt and top it up. So fun fact for ya. Cartoons and sleep is literally my life. Life. So what's in it? You could probably say it's just banana, um, kale, blueberries and raspberries. I've been awake for like two hours and I already need a nap. <laughs> I will be going to my Bubba's tonight for dinner. Bubba is my grandma. I was meant to be going with my boyfi and my brother but they both ditched me so... <laughs> I'm a lone wolf. I wanted to go to the gym, but I hate going by myself because I'm very unmotivated right now. And a lot of you are thinking, well, you're a personal trainer. Well, I'm a fucking human being and I'm unmotivated right now at this point in time. So I like going with people to train that motivates me and I have been bailed on. So no, I probably won't go. Life problems. <laughs> I've got lipstick on my teeth. Oh my god, how long has that been there? What's everyone up to this weekend? I don't have anything planned because I like being, I, I really, really do enjoy being a sloth. <laughs> I will get up at 6 o'clock on Saturday morning and motivate my boot campers for an hour and then I'll go be a sloth. That's, that's my life in a nutshell. 
I get paid to motivate other people while I sit here and be a sloth. Alright, so I'm just heading off to my bubbers now. I need fuel, I'm gonna have to get my wallet. Fuck. So I'm just on my way to my bubbers now for dinner. It's quarter to five, it's 34 degrees in my car, and my aircon doesn't work. I should probably put the window, the window down, that's better. But yeah, I can't fix my aircon at the moment because I can't afford it, so. Hopefully I make it there, I've got like no fuel. Wow, this is such a bad week, okay. Hey? I feel like I'm about to drive into a fire. It might not look like it on camera, but it's so close to where I am. And it's burning right ahead of me and to the left. So there's like multiple flames right now, and I don't know if that's where I need to turn down, and I'm freaking out. Holy shit. And now I've just ran into an accident there's an ambulance up the road but I don't want to film because I feel like that's bad but there's police like blocking off the road and an ambulance and a fire behind that I don't know if they're like related but that's pretty fucked up and fuck's sake I hope everyone's around I literally turned literally turned off the highway because of that fire it was a fire by the way at a massive bank up and I've hit the other side of the fucking road and there's another fucking bank up with cops. There's no flames at this one so maybe I don't even know but I need to feel really badly and if I don't get fuel I'm gonna break down in a fire. Finally. Hello. 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 So it's nine o'clock. I've just got home from dinner from my bubbers. Um, my phone died while I was there, so that's why there's not a lot of footage. Um, pretty lazy day actually, but um, boot camp tomorrow morning, nice and bright and early, so I've got to go to bed. Uh, Petey's not home yet. I'm um, thinking it's like a work function or something, so I probably won't see him till tomorrow morning when I wake up. Um, other than that, good night, guys, sweet dreams, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.